The five couples selected to be part of this year's wedding expos, Race to the Altar, have been given the opportunity to spend a day at the Arrow Point Nature Resort. While it was a day of fun for the couples, they were also being judged almost every step of the way. The journey began at Roraima Residence Inn, where the couples boarded a bus and headed up the east bank of Demerara to Timeri, where they boarded two boats and headed up the Kamuni River to Arrow Point. On their arrival, Captain Gerald Govias spoke to the participants on the grounds of the resort, where he tested their knowledge of the local indigenous culture and about Guyana's tourism product. You know, each one of y'all, there was a reason y'all get picked, you know. People had to fit three criteria. But I'm not going to tell you that now. I can tell you that this afternoon. Because after you pass through that first stage, which is a shortlisted down to five, then we still got to pick one of y'all as a lucky couple who, um, who will benefit from the wedding expo. Uh, generosity. First of all, how many of you have ever gone into the jungle before? Put up your hand. Who have never gone into the jungle? All right. <laughs> you don't worry. This resort is owned by Roraima, but it is on Amerindian lands, um, and so it is leased from the Armenian village. And, um, and the Armenian village and the people of this village is paid for, um, for everything that goes on here. So they, we, they, there's a lease for the land, there's a lease for every, every building in this land. Every person that comes to this resort, um, there's a tax that goes to the, to the community and so on. The couples then got ready to trek the jungle with tour guide Edward, young Gerald Govaya Jr. and other staff of the Roraima group. There were stops along the way where the guide explained interesting things about the jungle. The couples also got an opportunity to climb the hunter's platform. And then it was time for the kayaking. This part of the competition placed each couple in a kayak with paddles to journey back to the resort through Alligator Creek. To keep up with the couples, myself and cameraman Kareem also boarded a kayak. And after the kayaking, Captain Govaya sat down with the couples to find out a little more about them and find out why they think they deserve to win the competition. Well, I talk to a lot of women. I socialize a lot in different um, events and so on. But I, I think um, she's the one because um, she has all the qualities, or most of the qualities that um, I want in a woman. I was standing by the classroom. I had my notebook in my hands because I'm a person I like to write. I write a little bit about myself. I came out to the blues, collect the book, uh -huh. read what I have to write, what I had. Turn the page, you write his name, his address, telephone number. He's a serious name. man. <laughs> and then you write at the bottom, be with me the risk. We met 2000, 2007. At the start, she came to buy a his name dress. Go to church. I tried convincing her to buy one for me. She refused to. I had to walk the whole of the month just to get one for her. I wanted to get Troy's attention, so I started talking to the person next to me. <laughs> oh, that's the story. Yes, I started talking to the It was a tactic. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yes. <coughs> but it seemed as if he wasn't even paying attention to me. So I, I talked to the person. We talked a little. Uh, we exchanged numbers. And I. I was approaching my stop, so I came out of the bus, and I looked at him and smiled, and then the bus dro drove up, so like, fine, whatever. You flirt with yeah. You look at him and give you a little yeah, flirt. I, I look at him and I smile, and the bus drive up, so I thought that was it. I and I crossed the, the road. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I, cr I like crossed I the road, and um, <laughs> I heard him shouting, and I turned around, and it was him, and stopped the bus, and he came running. But that was not the end of the day's activities there was still a bike ride through the jungle trail. Okay. 
Hey Guyana, it's your girl Karen McAllister and I will turn her around. Okay, being at Arapon today has helped us to know more about Guyana and all that Guyana has to offer. We are couple number one and we look forward for you voting for us guys. We've been together for eight years and we have been engaged for three years. Looking forward to you voting for us. Thank you. Uh, it was really good, first of all. Working with the couples and being around them, it was really good. Um, the, the atmosphere was hospitable. Um, going through the, the trail for, um, uh, for the kayaking, you call it, um, that was really good. I basically learned how to paddle. <laughs> and it don't, it's not so easy as it seems. It's an art and it's a skill. Um, the mountain, um, riding through the mountain, that was really good. I enjoyed that. Actually, we had a really good time really enjoying ourselves and so um, we're looking to win this thing so vote for us um, we would appreciate that but everybody was having fun in my opinion everybody was having fun they're, everybody else said they're really nice people once after, you get to know them after you have gotten to know them are you more confident now and less confident that, okay i'm going to win this thing well it's a godly thing in life they say woe for you for you well, for me, could never be for you. So it's hopeful. So hopefully, Well, I wish you'd vote for me. <laughs> I know the Father in heaven knows that we deserve it.